video, we covered the parts of a point type ignition distributor. Point type distributor ignitions were the primary ignition system in the majority of all automobiles up until the mid 1970s. At that point, they were replaced by the much more accurate and dependable electronic ignition distributors and systems. This was a very important step in automotive technology as this was an era where fuel economy and reduced emissions were becoming one of the most important aspects of internal combustion engine and automotive development. The electronic distributor was a major improvement in ignition technology and while today it has been completely replaced by an even better distributorless ignition, there are still many thousands of vehicles on the road with electronic ignition distributors. Ignition operation aside, one of the big advantages of an electronic distributor was fewer wearing parts, resulting in no regular adjustments. The similarities to a point type distributor are the cap and rotor. The rotor is located on top of the distributor shaft and is indexed or keyed to only fit in one position. The distributor cap mounts on top, attaching to the distributor housing and closing the distributor, keeping it sealed. With the cap and rotor removed, you can see the big difference with an electronic distributor. Replacing the points is an electronic pickup. There are a few different types, but the most common was a Hall Effect unit, which passed a rotating magnetic field in front of a Hall Effect pickup that would detect the magnetic field. The signal generated by the Hall Effect unit is sent to an ignition module, which provides greater control and accuracy of the triggering signal for the ignition coil. Many of these distributors will also have a vacuum advance unit as well as mechanical advance weights and a condenser for radio suppression. Some electronic distributors house all their operational components. Others may locate them externally with only the pickup unit visible inside. Regardless of the style, most of these components are available separately. And while failure is not common, it can and will happen and your familiarity with these distributors will help you get your customer the right parts the first time. Thanks for watching.